Hey, it's Misty, and welcome back to Monster Hunter 3 Ultimate again. And I need to adjust my headphones, because that sounded really weird when I was talking like that. <laughs> anyway, we're going to take on that Sedeus. Yeah, save Moga Village, hunt a Sedeus. I'm not sure how you're supposed to pronounce that. I'll probably, uh, must bring Chacha and Kayamba. Uh-huh, I'm bringing them. Yep, there we go. Urgent quests. This is the last quest, I think. Unless there's one to, like, kill us a Deus later on. In low rank. I have brought a bunch of stuff with me in the, uh... In my inventory. Mega demon... Or not megas. Just demon drugs and armor skins. I probably should have made megas, but I didn't want to fight uh, Giganox. It's about Sekezu. There's the Cedeus. I think it's Sea Deus, because it makes sense, because it lives in the sea, and it's a sea dragon and all that. Sea Deus is actually weak to dragon, but I don't have a very good dragon weapon. I do have a dragon weapon that does some dragon damage, but this lightning longsword is probably my best bet for the time being. That are the lightning dual blades. There we go. And you only get 35 minutes in this. I don't really need the paintballs. The far caster I probably won't need either. Mini oxygen supply. Uh, Cha Cha has the ancient mask, which actually gives you oxygen when you hang. There might be a cooldown on it, but I, ox uh, I, I also brought uh, ten regular oxygen supplies. Underwater ballista ammo I bought from the Argosy. Uh, dash juices, just a lot of stuff. First things first. Team drug. Armor skin. Next, uh, ration up. I should probably just use the dash juices I brought, but maybe later. And I only brought mega potions with me because it's probably yeah I'm gonna use this. Probably shouldn't use those rations then, but it's fine. I did bring extra demon drugs and armor skins, but only for if I die because they oh that's the only uh, the only time they'd be useful. Sedeus has uh, four breakable parts. It is its horns, the back, uh, the closer back to it, not this part of the back. It, it has to be up there. Uh, the uh, the wiki calls it the hood, uh, but it, it's just its back. And you can break its tail as well. You can break its beard as well as all of those other things. It's actually weak to lightning, a little bit less than dragon. <laughs> I don't know why I did that. It's just kind of swimming forward. This is a very, very, uh, whoops, <laughs> kind of hit me there. Uh, I wouldn't say long quest, but like, it's going to keep going until it gets to that next area. Longsword is probably your, or is probably my best bet, rather. Uh, the horns are very hard. I wouldn't even focus on them in this area. You will have a better chance to uh, deal damage to them later on in that last area. Area 3. Ah. Dang fins. Let's try and get some spear combo off here. There we go, up to white. For right now, I'd focus on its back and its beard, and maybe its tail. Its uh, beard is actually one of its weakest parts. Uh, hold on, let me go back up to... there we go, and... Its weakest part is actually its beard, yes, for just about every damage. Impact damage is a little bit better time on the, uh, on the head than cutting damage does. But I'm not using a hammer. Really, a hammer wouldn't be the worst option in this quest, because it would do impact damage, so you might be able to knock it out. And it might help in it. Uh, the horns are a little bit weaker to impact damage, so... I don't know if it's moving right now. Oh, it's trying to attack me, isn't it? Oh, I missed, because it flinched out of the way. Uh, I'm just going to keep attacking, and... I'm going to keep an eye on my, uh, whatchamacallit, oxygen gauge, I suppose you'd call it, but, uh, 
It's going to keep moving forward, so you do need to keep up with it. Yeah, I, I don't need the paint bullets, so those are just free paint balls for me. <laughs> Actually should be attacking its beard or its face. Not its horns, but the beard or face. There, got the full bar. I suppose I could do the spirit combo on its beard. I brought a bunch of whetstones, because I figured this is going to be a monster that I actually didn't lock onto it. That uh, really needs you to smack it in the, uh, smack it in the everything for quite a while. <laughs> yeah. My uh, second best option would probably be in the dual blades, and I'd probably... I think my dragon dual blades only do like half the dragon damage that this does is for electric damage, so they're uh, five dragon damage instead of ten electric damage. And don't let those numbers fool you, it is actually five and ten, not fifty and a hundred. True attack values are rarely used in these games, and I prefer when they are used. It just gives you a better idea of what you're actually doing damage-wise. Now, each weapon has a damage multiplier on it for, uh, you know, if you're gonna, you know, <laughs> kind of just run in. I haven't healed yet. My, my, uh, I was gonna call them palicos or cats, but no, uh, my shaka lock is Chacha Gamera just kind of doing their thing. I'm just keeping my gauge up and it's just working out. <laughs> Now, I only have to repel this, which is fine, because by the time it gets into Area 3, I may have done enough damage to do that. But, uh, I couldn't... I can kill it if I do do enough damage to it. I want to break the horns. Once you break the horns, you can carve off them. This has some really good armor if you want to farm it right before, uh... Right before higher rank, which is next. Oh! It's trying to suck... No, it's trying to blow. It's sucking and then blowing. But that is why I wanted uh, water-resistant armor, and this is water-resistant armor. Not that much, but uh, anything's helpful. Oh, <laughs> well, I at least hit it there. Probably sharpen up here. All right. I'm just going to use a mini oxygen supply since they gave me one, and it fills me up anyway. I could heal, but I don't feel like it's quite necessary. I'm gonna go down to yellow because I haven't been attacking you enough to. Uh, oh. <laughs> yeah, sometimes its movements just kind of hit you inadvertently. I mean, it kind of makes sense. It's a giant elder dragon. It's gonna be a bit, bit big. Kind of, its swimming is gonna hurt. Not even swimming into you on purpose. <laughs> Kind of there. We're about to get into the next area, but now <laughs> it actually turned around to do that on purpose. Yeah, slammed into something there. Yeah, this is why I put the uh, well, one of the reasons I put the, uh, dance to just increase my health every now and again. Uh, health recovery large on the Chakalak is there. We are going into the next area soon, but it's just... I keep making it flinch or making it mad so it doesn't uh, actually go in there. Okay, I actually hit it there. Sweet. Put that away. I feel like I've done a lot of damage to this thing. I've actually tried to fight the uh, G-Rank or... The one that you need to get into G-Rank uh, by myself, it is very hard to do solo. <laughs> and I feel I've done more damage to this than I've ever done to that. I, I know this will have less health, but I mean, even with this weapon, it's lower... Lower, uh... Quality, I suppose you... Lower rarity. It does lower damage. I feel like I'm just doing better overall. Right, it's going to the next area, so might as well just follow it. Plenty of 
right behind me, so... They do give you a couple of uh, air pockets here where you can just kind of swim into them. I should just really be uh, standing around about here. Let's get up to the beard and do some damage to that. Oh, hey, did I make you flinch? That's nice. Let's do some damage to your head then. Sweet. Oh, one of its horns grew into its eye. And it, this is what's been causing the earthquakes in Moga Village, by the way. It's just been ramming its head into the uh, into the ground. It might be trying to break off that horn so its eye'll eye'll come back or something. I don't know. Nope, didn't get quite enough. Oh well, that didn't even do enough to a hit at all. It's very hard to gauge where I'm going to be hitting this thing. <laughs> if I'm going to be hitting it at all, that is. I wonder if you can kill it before it gets to Area 3. That'd be nice, but I highly doubt it. Oh, come on. <laughs> Let's get in there. Hit a little harder. Nope, nothing there. Let's get up to its face and try and get some hits there. The, uh... I want to be hitting it towards the beard anyway. Oh, my stamina depletation has resumed. I forgot that I had uh, taken a Mega Dash juice. Come on. And I hit. There we go. Alright, my bar is back to glowing. Ah, I was hoping that would hit or it would like undulate up into my uh, into my attack. Come on. Nope. Try and like dive into it. I mean don't dive into an attack or preferably don't stand on its fins. Come on. There we go. Weapon power has decreased. Doesn't matter for spirit strikes, but I do not want to be attacking too much more with yellow. Yep. Okay. Ow. Okay, we're just going to sharpen then. Alright, sharpen. And I have slotted sharpener into this, so I only have to do one cycle of sharpness. Of sharpening, rather. I'm just going to whack you a bit. Oh, we need to be attacking breakable parts a little more often. That's not gonna help. That's not gonna help at all. Some underwater ruins around here. It's kind of cool. Where'd it go? Oh, it's up there. Oh no, <laughs> nearly out of stamina. You know Speaking of being nearly out of stamina. Oh, it's doing that thing again. Okay, well, avoided that attack. Now let's try and get to where I can hit it again. That is apparently not where I can hit it again. Where is that? There we go. Nope, that was it just flailing its entire body into me. Come on, Nessie. And I suppose it looks nothing like the Loch Ness Monster. Hey, I actually hit it there. I was wondering if that would actually hit its fin or something. Or... Ow. Would uh, you know, just kind of whiff. It hit the fan, but uh, man, my depth perception down here is terrible. Okay, I am keeping an eye on my. Uh, actually, speaking of me, keeping an eye on my uh, stamina. Or not stamina, oxygen. Yeah, you can. Cha Cha just became an air pocket, so I could uh, breathe in the 
flowing waters of Lake Minnetonka. That makes no sense. I don't breathe water. This thing might breathe water, but I certainly don't. Now. <laughs> I get back in there. Come on. I have no... <laughs> this is going to be a long quest, is it? It may have to get to Area 3 before I can repel it. And it may have to get to Area 3 before I can kill it. Oh, hey. <laughs> I think I really made that go reeling, so... That's nice. Hey, I actually hit something there. That's nice. Very, very nice indeed. Oh, I broke its tail. I'm somewhat surprised, to be honest. I did not think I had been doing near enough tail damage for that. Bring it back? Nope. It's booking it now. Well, at least I can swim for, like, an indefinite period of time. Get some damage done. Put that down. It may be trying to rush into the third area just because it's taken enough damage that uh, third area is appropriate because it is not going very slowly, that's for sure. Can I hit you here? Just need to hit you a bit. Yeah, I don't think it wants to be anywhere other than Area 3 right now. Oh. Well, it has to break that first. Okay. Can I? Well, I broke it. Put that away and get this dash used in. No. Yes. So we're just going in the area. I have time to do that. I'm just going to sharpen up again. Used all of their whetstones. Time to use mine. No, I think I used one of them already. Either that or I forgot to restock to 15. Here we go. Yeah, that's like right over its eye. It cannot see over that, out of that one. Nope. It's doing the thing, only even more so. I guess it's enraged now, and it couldn't get enraged before? Well, there's just, like, lyrics in here. I don't want to get to that yet. I want to... There's, like, Balliste in here somewhere. I forget where. Come on, give me a ballista. I'm looking for a... Uh, maybe over there? I know there are some ballistas in here, but I just don't recall where. Uh-oh. It's, it's, it's trying to in, ingest me, I suppose you would say. They're like in the ruins somewhere, but... have a... Maybe there's one there? Come on. Come on. It doesn't appear to be one here? Oh! Up there. There's got to be one up there. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Run, 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 run. I'm, I'm locked onto it. I just need to make sure it's not attacking me at the moment. Uh, i got to get a little higher, don't I? And this is why I drink the stamina juice. I just need to look around. There's one. Where is it? It's down there. Alright. Let me just aim this. Alright, and... Uh, how do you... Oh, right, that way. Alright, a, a little lower. I said lower. Okay, there we go. Just trying to aim at the... Really trying to aim at the horns, but... And i got to change the underwater ballistic, or the ballistic controls in general. Okay, 
Now it's definitely angry. Okay. Okay, at least hit with one of those. Okay, that's not gonna hit. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, it's up a little, uh, down a little. Nope, I, oh, I at least hit its fin. Oh, I'm out of ammo. Yeah, I believe I'm out of ammo. That's okay. Well, let's get in there, because I'm going to lose my uh, spear gauge if I don't. Come on. I could also just, like, look for more ammo, because there is ammo in here. I just brought some with me because I wanted to, uh... uh I wanted to, uh, use it on the straightaway. But I probably should have realized that the ballista were a little higher. Okay. The tail's not the worst place to be attacking, but I want to be attacking its beard and preferably its back and horns as well. And break all those things. I need it to hold still. Come here. Did you just like stay in one place for a little while? There we go. Where's it going? Meh. Coming up. Is it trying to do a... Like a super attack because it needs to be higher? I don't know. Is it trying to get Cha-Cha? Is it just leaving? Can't be leaving. Come on. Is there anything to gather around from here? Is it Dragonator? Where is the Dragonator? Is it like yeah, that didn't hurt too much at least? I'd use it, but I need to know where this are these the spikes? These have to be the spikes. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Where is it? It needs it to be down here. So. Okay, now's a good time to use it. Boom! Right in the horns. Oh, and I broke one of its horns off. Well, actually, they're both broken. It's just one of them breaks off and you can carve it. Is it the big one that broke off or it's a small one? Probably the big one. And where are you? You're right there. Yep, yeah, it's the big one. Yeah, I'm gonna... That does do a ton of damage to it, too. Pretty sure it's percentage based on its health. And on. Uh, I just... There we go. We got one or two cars off of this thing. Two cars. Nice. And another one. I'm pretty sure its horn's still pretty hard, so I would, uh... Advise attacking not that. Alright. Ah, oh, nuts. Okay, where am I? Considering I have used one Mega Potion, I'm doing pretty good on this quest. Right, let's just try and get some damage done. I don't care where I hit. I want to... I want the Spirit combo to actually take off. Oh, it's trying to hit me. It hit me. Come on, just put your weapon away. I don't care if you heal. You don't really need to. I prefer to just do damage to its beard. Right below its beard is also pretty weak, so that's a decent place to... Uh, I was hoping I could get, wait for it to... Uh, uh, whatchamacallit? Um, wait for the spirit attack to like end and then just hold it for a little while and then, then do the final move, but I uh, waited a little too long. That's okay. Let's do that thing again. Just be careful where you're positioned, and you should be fine. I need to get higher. Ow. I need to get my spirit gauge back up to red. But that does take a minute. Hey, it's no longer enraged. Not falling debris. Gotta watch that. Falling Debra's. 
I once had a babysitter named Deborah. I don't know. Just thought it would be some interesting trivia. What do you mean that's not how you pronounce Deborah? <laughs> Nope. I tried to wait again. Eh, it wouldn't have worked anyway, but still. This is going to try and run into me, isn't it? Kind of glad I hit with that Dragonator, by the way. That's a lot of damage. Trying to just see if I can't inadvertently hit something. No, but I got closer, and that's good. I have broken two parts, so that's also good. Stamina depletion is resumed. That's fine. Let's see if Cha Cha is ready to give me some more oxygen. You can do a couple of regular attacks in between spirit attacks, but. I tend not to because I'm lazy. Cha Cha, thank you for the oxygen. It's enraged again, but that's fine. Alright, how are we doing? Also fine, but I should heal and run away. Okay, it's after someone else, so that's a good, good time to heal. Probably a good time to Mega Dash Juice as well. Oops, I did not mean to do that. I meant to do that. I know, only 10 minutes left. You get very, very little time on an Elder Dragon quest. It, it, usually it's under 35 minutes. Oh, weapon power has decreased. I didn't even notice. I didn't hit anything with that, but that's okay. I need it to, like, kind of reel or something, because I wanted to barrel bomb it. But I didn't want to barrel bomb it before it was in this, uh, before it was in this area. And then we just kind of depth charge him. There we go. That's some good damage. Oh, objective complete. He's dead. <laughs> is that repel, or is that, uh... That was just Repel. Okay, I don't actually have to kill him until next time. I will kill him next time. Not actually going to show the kill quest, because it's exactly the same as this. It's just... you can kill him. I just repelled it. So... <laughs> Still, even repelling it took like... What? 25? 30 minutes? I don't know, I just use a bunch of their stuff because they gave it to me for free. And just down all of this crap. <laughs> I gotta keep a Farcaster and some paintballs though. That's also why I took this armor. It's like the most armor I can have at this point. I also ate for Defender High if you didn't realize because that was going off once in a while. Anyway, quest complete. Alright, and I have... I think there's a cutscene because I... repelled this today. I'm about to say kill, but... I did not kill this today, as I repelled it. I might have to kill it, but even if I don't... I wonder if this cutscene changes if you don't break off its horn. Probably not. Okay, and there's a bunch of music that's probably going to get copyright pinged. Luckily, it's just a copyright claim and not a strike or anything, so... Cutscene, and then uh, there's either going to be a quest I need to do... Well, I'm going to do it anyway. Need to do for high rank, or it'll just give me the high rank urgent right away. Regardless, I'm probably just going to do the high rank urgent next time, instead of... You know, the uh, quest to kill the Sedeus. Sedeus? I... whatever you want to call it. It doesn't really matter. Congratulating me, and they can't show me there because they didn't want to put a bunch of uh, work into making every different armor that you'd be. They could just set you in the default armor they gave you. <laughs> I don't know. There's Cha Cha. 
wonder where Kayamba went. I have no idea, but uh, gonna need to keep. To, uh, he's dancing through the night. <laughs> I wonder if uh, Shakalakas have like the same thing uh, Kajalakas do, and their face is just a black void of nothingness. Yeah, this is definitely gonna get copyright thing. I can't really do much about it other than like dispute the claim, and then it'll go away in a couple of weeks. But whatever. Oh hey! Let's see, Sunspire Jewel, a scale, a scale, a hide, a hide, some fur, and a hide. Wow, <laughs> a lot of stuff added to the gallery. Yeah, but there's a lot, uh, or not a lot, but a very good set of Sedeus armor if you want to make that before you get into high rank, because it makes uh, very, very powerful armor. I'm going to just talk to everybody. I, just, I, I really want to wait until, uh... Okay. Wait for it. I, I just need to... You know, just give me a Royal Ludra scale, because I hunted one of those in between videos. Come on. Alright. Might see. That's fine. Talk to the Argosy, then. Oh, he's giving me a longsword. Sweet. Barbarian blade. Oh, now he's got to talk to me again. Oh, no. I don't need to trade with you right now. I'll check that longsword out in a minute. Yeah, she's real happy that I saved the village, but now they're saying I can go to high rank quests, I think. Or at least give me an urgent. Wow, that is a lot of dialogue. Yeah. Point. This was my first true roadblock in Monster Hunter. Just Monster Hunter in general. The purple Lou Droth, this specific urgent quest. I probably failed it like three or four times. Anyway, I'm going to look at that longsword and then we're going to call it because this has been a long video. Manage equipment. Oh, wow. Wow, that is a nice longsword. 528 raw, 100 water, 10 affinity. Yeah, this is, this is great. I'm going to see if I can upgrade this real quick. Then I'll call it. This is like my most powerful weapon right now. I can. Bar bar barbarian Blade, Barbarian Shark. Uh, Dewey Plura. I know, I think I know where that comes from. Wyvern Stone, not sure about that one. Shark Skin's gonna be a pain in the butt to get, but... Really, that may not be a bad target for my... mid-game upgrade. A lot of blue on that, too. Anyway, we're going to call it here. I hope you enjoyed. Feel free to like, comment, subscribe. Thanks for watching. Catch you next time, and have a good one.